Okay, here we are doing the um, latitude and longitude with minutes. With minutes, which is usually when you're sort of uh, more more zoomed in and you now have a pretty good gap or space between each degree of longitude or latitude. So, uh, first up here we're looking for, let's say, the latitude of A. And we'll look um, right here on New York State. So, latitude... Uh, of A. So maybe what you should do, and I'm going to do it like this, I'm going to try to get this straight. It's a little tricky for me. I'm going to draw this across like this. Okay? That is a latitude line for A. And it is not on 43 and it's not on 44. So it's kind of between them. So it's going to be 43 degrees and some minutes. So this is about um, between here and here. So one, one degree in this case is broken up into 60 minutes. That's the symbol for, for minutes. Therefore, this little halfway is 43 degrees, and that's 30 minutes, okay, would be the subdivision. So this, and I'm kind of eyeing it up, maybe it's about, it's not really halfway, so maybe it's 43 degrees and 10 minutes. Maybe 15, either one of those would work, but you know, don't do 12, don't do 11, or don't do 17, just near as 5. So maybe it's 43 degrees and, and um, 10 minutes, and that would be north. 43 degrees, 10 minutes, and it would be north. Uh, you probably, and you could also put 15 minutes, that would be fine, there is a good amount of leeway there. Okay, now let's do the longitude of A. Longitude of A, I'm going to draw it in right here as best I can, straight up and down. Okay, so this is a longitude line, so it's between 75, 75 and 76. And notice, because they're, it's going 74, 75, 70, it's going up this way, so it's going to be 75 and some amount of minutes. So 75 to 76, there's 60 minutes in here. This is um, 30 minutes, 75 degrees and 30 minutes. And this is off a little bit. I'm going to estimate it to be about 25 minutes. Again, we just go to the nearest 5, so I'll do 75 degrees and 25. 75 degrees, 25 minutes. And then the next question is north, south, east, or west. So uh, as we said before, the numbers get lower this way. If there was zero longitude, it would be way off this way. Zero would be way, way over here. I'm probably off screen here. I'm not sure. Way over here. Way off that way. And then, uh, therefore, this line would be what direction from it? West. Therefore, it is west. Okay. Um, let's do the another one. Let's erase this just out of our way here. And let's do... And there goes the clock, the tractor clock. The tractor engine sounds, and uh, there we go. All right. Now it's weird in the background. Let's do... Um, latitude of B. Latitude of B is right there, go like this. So now I'm right... Uh, here, 44, 45, again, that's 60 minutes here, so that's 44 degrees and 30 minutes north, and maybe that's about 25, 44 degrees, 25 minutes north, 44 degrees, 25 minutes north. All right, let me just do a couple here, let me do, uh, let me do uh, this one. Draw a dot at, the, at uh, these coordinates and label it H. Let's see, you know what, let me get can we get another one here? Here we go. Nice clean copy. So, 41 degrees, 50 minutes north, label it H. The best thing to do is I'm going to find 41 degrees, 50 minutes north. So, 41 degrees, and so this is 30, and then i got to think, so if this is 30, about halfway of that would be 45, so 50 is probably right about there. That's probably about 50 minutes. So, I like to go like this. Put my ruler on there, draw a line. So that's my latitude. And then 7440. Okay? 
74 is right here, 75 is there. So this is 74 degrees and 30 minutes. And so it's a little hard because it's, it's at an angle, but uh, halfway to f from these two is 45. So maybe 40 is about, about here. Again, a reasonable estimate will work. Okay? But using a ruler is something you should do to get it nice and, and as, as accurate as you can. Now right where they meet, I'm going to draw a dot there, right there, and I will label it H. See how that works? Okay, let's uh, let's do one here using the Earth Science reference table. I have some reference table pages, and let's do longitude of slide mountain. Now this gets a little more jumbled. There's a lot to this map. There's other things. The the patterns here show uh, rock types. We won't be using that. We're going to be using these um, latitude and longitude. So you got to look around for a lot of these slide mountains right here. So uh, let's get the Actually, what's the question? What's the question asking here? The question is asking the longitude of slide mountain. Okay, longitude of slide mountain. And so what I'm going to do is go. I'm trying to get this as straight as I can. I'm going to go like this. And draw it on there. And the problem down here is tough. I would probably go to the top up here. Go to the, you see that? Yeah, I go to the top up here. 74 degrees in zero minutes. This is 75 degrees. Again, 60 minutes here. That's 74 degrees, 30 minutes. So that's probably a good guess. Is a good not guess. A good estimate is probably 74 degrees and maybe 20 minutes. And again, if this is 74 and 73 is here. As I go this way, I will go towards zero. If zero is way off to this side, all this is west of zero, so compass direction west, you have to have that on there. Okay, 7420, that is the, that would be longitude 74 degrees, 20 minutes west. Uh, latitude of Buffalo, next one, latitude of Buffalo. So you gotta look around. And all of the things here are usually labeled. I do want to point out before you go any further, if you have to find Riverhead, it's not something that people in our area are common with. Riverhead is down here. Okay. Um, and Buffalo is right here. And I believe I'm doing, I'm doing Latitude of Buffalo. So Buffalo is that dot. Okay. The name is there, but the dot's right there. So I will, and this is where it gets tricky again because I like to line my, make it straight on here. See that 43 and 43, you make it straight on there, which I think I'm pretty good at. Okay? And it's a little weird here, 43, 42, so I like to go over to this side as long as my line is nice and straight and realize that this is 42 degrees north, 43 degrees north, uh, 40, this halfway, 42 degrees 30 minutes, um, and then I'm going to, this is, this is basically 42 degrees 60 minutes, so halfway here. That's probably 45 minutes, so maybe that's about 50 minutes. So I like 42 degrees, 50 minutes, and that is, um, that would be north because the equator, if this is 44, 43, the equator would be way down here. All of these lines are north of the zero of the equator, so therefore 42 degrees, 42 degrees, 50 minutes north. Okay. Latitude of Old Forge. You know what? I think that's pretty good. I'm at about nine minutes here. I think that those two get the, get the point across. It's just often just requires a good amount of just doing them, trying them, taking the best, uh, you know, putting forth good effort, and realizing the 60 minutes in each degree. And uh, good luck, and you should do fine. You should do fine.